Welcome back to MPFC TV. Joining me this time is goalkeeper John Stewart. John, quite a difficult week on and off the pitch. How are you feeling about things? Um, yeah, it's been a strange, sad, difficult week um, for a lot of for the players, for the staff, for the club itself. Um, you didn't never expect a, a tragedy like that to happen. So yeah, it's been hard. Um, it was good to get to training on Thursday with the lads. Um, we all came together and I think the lads needed to get some uh, frustration and energy out. So we had a good session on Thursday. Um, and uh, we're here today and it's been, uh, been amazing. Uh, the fans, the people that have turned up, the t togetherness of the squad and, and, the, and the managerial staff has been, been amazing. It, it was clear to, I think, to everyone, Jordan was very close to all the players in particular. I've not, I don't think I've seen anyone have a bad word to say about him. Everyone thought a lot of him. How has it affected you personally? Because you've been like been through something like this before. Yeah. Um, it's a shock. All I can say is a massive, massive shock. And it's a shame and it's sad um, to go from your usual routine of coming in matches and seeing, you know, you, you see 20 odd players, but you know every single one of them and, and you appreciate every single one of them. I mean, for me, I, when I come in, I shake everyone's hand and um, to go from that every training session, every match to obviously he's not here is, is hard to take. And I mean, there's, there's some of the lads in there that share the same car with him to training and to matches and, and, and they've really struggled. Um, so yeah, it's, it's difficult, difficult. Lucky enough, not lucky enough. I've been through this before and I kind of, I know what emotions to expect and, and when they're gonna come. And, and I think obviously the majority of the lads haven't, so they, they didn't know how to. It's been a strange week, strange week. A lot of consoling and a lot of uh, conversation with, with the lads to make sure they're all right. Because we, we've spoke previously as well, earlier in the season, how much of a close-knit group it is. It's not just a case of you all turn up on match day. You, you've all very much close friends outside of it, right? mm. We are. We've got a really good bond together. A really good bond. Um, you know how it is in this football game. You, you, you know everyone before they've came, or the majority of players. Um, so it's just how quick you can bond together. And here, we've, we've done it ever so quickly. And, um, you know, our class... Has, a lot of these players as family, if the, most of them, uh, you know, so um, it's been a difficult week. To talk about the game very briefly, a 1-1 draw could have very easily been three points to that lot. Mm. Lads, including yourself, went out there today and did Jordan very much proud. How did you feel the game went on the whole? Um, as good as it can be, really. I think after what, what's gone on, um, the kind of game took second place, which it's natural and it's right. Um, I think uh, it was a, a different day for everyone. It was a strange one, um, you know, hard, hard to take and, and, and hard to deal with. I mean, you know, just lining up to go out for the game was, was hard enough, um, let alone playing it. But I thought the lads done themselves uh, amazing. And um, yes, yeah, it's, it's a shame about the uh, draw when we could have definitely got three points. Um, but that's football. We, we didn't get the chance to see that fantastic celebration um, when P2 scored, everybody over holding up to Jordan Sinek's shirt. That must have brought up some real emotion in all the lads. Mm, yeah. Um, it's been about five or six times today where I could have welled up, and I think a, a few of the lads did. Um, just goes to show what, a, what an amazing man he was. It does indeed, and I mean, I, I've got to send plaudits from myself to all our lads and of course the Sinnott family here today. It, it's incredible strength to even go out and get on the field, but to, to play 90 minutes and play with the gusto we did, it's something you must be incredibly proud of in yourself and all the lads. Yeah, for sure. I mean, like I said, I class every one of these lads as family, and I'm, I'm proud of all of them today. Um, they've been, been amazing, they've dealt with it as best as they can. and. Um, I can't, can't speak highly enough of them, um, but also the, the management team that have came in, they've been amazing since they, since they came in last week under tragic circumstances. Um, 
I think he's gave the lads a, a real push. Um, I think you could see that today in the, in the game. And um, yeah, looking forward to, to the next few games. Thank you for your time, George Stewart. Cheers.